Declan, listen to me. Think about what you're doing. Is this what you want? You killed Nick. You killed Dennis. You're running the drug ring in Basswood. If only you could have left it at that. But you had to poke around again. Now I have two witnesses to deal with, thanks to you. This is bad. Be careful. Every word will count from now on. You have to lower his guard long enough for you and Anna to gain the upper hand. It's gonna be hard, but remember, I'm with you. Every word of the way. Tell me exactly why I shouldn't kill both of you right here. Keep your cool. He's not gonna shoot if he thinks he has better options. Otherwise, he already would have. Oh, ich weiß nicht. Ich sag bestimmt wieder genau das Falsche, obwohl ich was anderes möchte. Because it's not what you want. The sooner you understand it, the better. I've changed my opinion of you, Sammy. You're not that clever. You still can't keep your mouth shut when you should. Look, I don't want to do this, but I promise. It ain't personal. Don't delude yourself. Nothing is more personal than this. And you won't do it. What makes you think that? Seen into my soul? He wants things to stay as they were, to cover up the whole story. If he thinks you'll get in his way, he won't hesitate to pull that trigger. Three people gunned down the same day is bound to attract attention. You're a cop, Declan. You know the next strangers in town will be the feds. I could make you disappear. Ditch your corpses somewhere. No one would know. Come on, Declan, we talk to people, followed leads. And if we just go missing, Walter, Bess, people who know us will ask questions. You seem to think you could just walk away. Go ahead, tell me how that happens. For all his bad boy act, it's clear he wants insurances. To know he's safe. Deep down, he thinks everyone is as crooked as he is. Take the proof Dickie stole and let us go. We won't tell anyone. You know where our family and friends live, after all. And that would be enough to keep you from talking. Why should I trust you? You're you. You care about stories, not people. You published that article and sank the whole town, leaving saps like me to clean it up. If I let you go, who's to say it won't be the same thing all over again? You know, as a criminal and as a cop, he's probably seen lots of desperate people doing desperate things. Stay calm. Appear confident. You staring down the barrel of his gun is already having an effect on him. I told the inconvenient truth once and it destroyed my life. It destroyed a lot of lives. I won't make that mistake again. Learned your lesson, huh? After all, you didn't call the police after you found Dennis. That was a smart move. You do seem smarter than the last time you were in town. I must say, Higgs, you might have found yourself a way out of this. How about you just hand over the evidence, Anna? Nice and easy. It all comes down to this, Sam. Anna's about to jump him. Keep his attention on you. Ich könnte jetzt schreien, Anna, schnapp ihn dir. Und wenn ich schreie, guckt er vielleicht auf mich. Anna, now! No, you don't! Anna! Hello? A 
woman has been shot. I need an ambulance. Just hurry. Anna, can you hear me? I need you to stay with me. I need you to... This is one funeral I can't avoid. Ich meine, es ist ja rein theoretisch nur die allerletzte Entscheidung gewesen, die nicht lief wie geplant. Sonst waren wir auf einem guten Weg. Sam, you got a moment? I hope you know you've got my honest sympathies. If there's anything the Basswood Police Department can do for you, or even just little old me, you give me a holler, all right? For now, I wanted to tell you. We found Declan's fingerprints on Dennis's gun. Dickie's statement also corroborates your testimony. No charges are going to be filed against you. It's clear self-defense. Still hard to believe a man I trusted was running a drug ring. Here. She's worried about her re-election chances as sheriff. She's playing cleanup for the whole police force right now. Before you answer, just remember, it's always nice to have a police chief as a friend. Und dann kommt die dicke Überraschung, Anna lebt und wir sind einfach auf Dicklens Beerdigung. It wasn't your fault. No one saw it coming. I still would have trusted him with my life. He was serious, dedicated. Looking back, maybe obsessed. That's a rot that grows deep under the floorboards. I didn't see it either. What happened isn't on you. Thanks, officer. Bess, hon. I've known you too long for you to call me anything else. Anyway, I guess I've kept you long enough. I'll let you go now. Look after yourself, Sam. Just remember, this funeral isn't about you. Or even Anna. It's about everyone. Us mourners sharing catharsis. I could use some of that today. Listen. Empathize. Express yourself. Let them see she mattered to you. Don't be afraid and you'll be fine. Okay, ist doch Anna. Hey Ethan. Sam? I'm uh, not sure what to say. I know you and Anna were close. I I'm sorry about what happened. I appreciate that. Hey, um... I never apologized for trashing the bar that night. I'm sorry. <sighs> Forget it. It's not the first brawl I've had in my bar. It won't be the last. So, you, uh, holding up all right? Not gonna lie. I've been better, but it's one day at a time, I guess. Well, sounds like you're on the right path. Well, listen, uh, next time you're at the Haven, let me buy you a beer, all right? I'll probably take you up on that. Wow. But thank you for this beer. It's been a rough week. 
Yes, it has. Maybe the roughest I have ever seen. And I've lived almost twice as long as you. He's completely lost faith in himself. First Nick, now Anna. And he's convinced he could have prevented Nick's death if he had only listened. He doesn't want to retire so much as he thinks he should retire. Walter, don't blame yourself for what happened. None of this was your fault. You can't let it get to you. And honestly, what would the Basswood Jungle be without its famous chief editor? How did you... Is it that obvious? Well, I did think about retiring, yes. But maybe the ship still needs its captain. I could go for another journey. Thank you for the kind words, Sam. It means a lot, it really does. What about you? Did you have time to consider... what comes next? I'm not planning to stay in town. Nothing for me here anymore. Hard to blame you. As for me, I may stay around a bit longer than I was expecting. I don't think you'll ever leave, Walter. Well, it's like you said. Sometimes you need to ride until you can't anymore. Basswood is my town, the jungle is my home. And you'll always be welcome at both. After all, it might be time for you to settle down. Life is short and fleeting, like the sunset. If you pay attention, it can be beautiful. If you don't, it's gone before you even know it happened. Anyway, I've rambled on long enough. Make sure to look after yourself, Samuel. Same to you. The Walter. I'm sorry you got mixed up in all this. You're angry. You have every right to be. I should press charges. You could have killed people. If you have some... You put your own desires above the safety of those around you. You lost sight of everything but your goal. I will not go to the police. We don't do that. But do not set foot on my land ever again. Oh. Bug? I know how you feel. I miss her so much. I wish I hadn't given Anna such a hard time before. She didn't want to be a stepmother and... I didn't want to be a stepdaughter. Now, I don't know. I'll never know if it could have been okay. I shouldn't have told you about my dad. You had to tell someone. I'm just glad you trusted me. I know, Muley. I always knew you'd listen. Even when I was mad at you. <laughs> I told you it was a mistake to indulge her back at the pub. Well, I officially admit that I was wrong, and now I can see why. It just... If I hadn't said anything, this wouldn't have happened to Anna. But I was so mad about my dad. So mad that I couldn't even cry. Well, I couldn't until now. Until I finally knew what happened. And that makes me feel selfish. Like all of this happened because of me. Come here. So, it's not my fault? It isn't anyone's fault. No one alive, at least. I still feel bad. I know. But it's not your fault. Sam. Of course, she just walks off. I don't know how to reach that girl. It was hard before, but now she's completely shut me out. She's still trying to make sense of all that's happened. She's been through a lot. Maybe Basswood just isn't the right place for her anymore. You don't understand. It's not that easy to leave. Kathy, I'm not here to judge. I just want to help. I know, I know. It's 
sorry. I've just been dealing with so much lately. You've always managed to get Joan to talk to you. Any advice? Now, Sam, we need to be really careful about this. Kathy's already on edge. Joan noticed her mom is overdoing the painkillers, but we can't just kick the door down and confront her directly. Kathy, Joan is distant because she feels you haven't been yourself lately. She told me at times it's like you don't see her. It's nothing against her. I've just been working myself ragged, and I hurt my back, and... She said it wasn't just that. She's noticed the pills. It's the only way I can deal with my back, and it helps with... with other things. Look, I can't imagine how hard it is to raise a child by yourself, but I don't want to see Joan grow apart from the last parent she has. Oh, God. I... I... I didn't realize it got that bad. You're right. I need to get help. Sam, could I... Could I count on you to help look after Joan every now and then? She needs the people she loves close to her right now. I'd love to. I get along better with her than most adults. I just... I thought I could do this alone. I'm here to help in any way I can. Thank you. And if you ever need something, know your family. I need to talk to my daughter. Hey, I'm real sorry about Anna. Uh oh, that one is not Joe. We are all grieving. Time for you to step in. She needs to know that she's not alone. Christina, I know how you feel. I'll always have that hole in my heart where she used to be. She's never coming into my shop again. No, she won't, and it hurts. But you have to remember her for all the good moments you two shared. And you can bet that wherever she is, she misses your coffee. <laughs> I'm sure she does. Thank you, Sam. There have just been too many funerals lately. Yes, there has, madam. Thank you. You have a way with words, young man. Misery loves company, Sam. You did well. Sam, we really have to stop meeting like this. Did you change your hair? You seem different. I'm so sorry. I should have stopped her. He's got a lot of rage in him. A lot of self-loathing. Maybe try and derail that. I knew she was in danger. Poker face has always been crap. But I trusted her. I trusted you. I couldn't imagine my little girl. Like this. I should have stopped you both. I should have killed that son of a bitch. No one could have stopped Anna from doing the right thing. I know. But I like to think I could have. It helps. It 
Sam. You're the only one who might know the pain I'm going through. He needs to know the people who hurt his daughter have been punished. He needs to hear from you that all of this is over. It's over. The man who hurt your daughter and Nick is gone. No one got away with anything. That's the only thing that comforts me. You know, she never regretted having you in her life. She'd want you to know that. Ich hätte gern noch diese reflektieren Option genutzt. Anna Anna was she was words. You spend your whole life devoted to them. Yet they fail you when you need them most. I miss her. I miss her. And uh, and I don't think I have anything else. You should say something. Let people know you're grieving with them. You don't have to suffer alone. They're here for you, and you're here for them. It's a lot of weight to speak about someone who's gone. How do you start? Anna had a heart bigger than this whole town. We all managed to fit in there. It didn't matter where you came from, what you did, she still cared about you. There's going to be a lot less heart in this town without her. Anna always wanted to make sure people's voices would be heard. She used her platform to elevate those left behind, those hurting in silence. And she wouldn't stop until they got the justice and respect they deserved. She was braver than me, than anyone I ever met. She never ran from a fight. We honor Anna every time we look at someone and realize they're alive. Every time we stop to consider their feelings. Every time we open ourselves up. Every time we care about the person standing next to us. That's how we honor her. Goodbye, Anna. You'll be missed. Strong words. Strong words. <laughs> She'd have loved that. Well said. Vorbei.
Boah, Fazit. Richtig gutes Spiel. Hat mir sehr, sehr, sehr gut gefallen. Ja, GG, geschafft. Das ist so deprimierend. Ja, der Stream ist halt sehr deprimierend. Erst das Okabi bei Planet zu und jetzt Anna. Glaubst du, es wird sowas wie einen zweiten Teil geben? Hm, wenn es Don't Not macht, wie bei Life is Strange, dass quasi Teil 1 und Teil 2 nichts miteinander zu tun hat, dann kann das schon sein. Ähm, dass die vielleicht sagen, wir machen in dieser Art nochmal ein Spiel. Aber ich glaube nicht, dass das geplant ist. Aber Don't Not an sich, die machen ja viele Spiele in diese Richtung. Life is Strange, Life is Strange Before the Storm, Life is Strange 2, Life is Strange True Colors, was demnächst irgendwann erscheint. Ähm Captain Spirit ist so ein kleines Mini-Game, würde ich es mal nennen, ist glaube ich auch von Don't Not. Und Tell Me Why ist auch von Don't Not. Also. Die machen viele Spiele in dieser Art. Ähm, aber ob es jetzt quasi Twin Mirror 2 geben wird, weiß ich nicht. an sich, ich mag, ich mag ja an sich die Art von solchen Spielen, dieses Adventure Ding, wo du Sachen entscheiden musst und du quasi die Geschichte beeinflusst ähm voller Herzschlag hier ähm ich finde es aber gut, dass es in diesem Spiel keine Quicktime Events gab weil bei Quicktime-Events bin ich immer raus. Quicktime-Events vermasseln mir immer die ganze Story, weil ich das falsche Zeug drücke und ich deshalb nicht das Ergebnis bekomme, was ich möchte. Äh, gerne, Nico. Ich bin auch froh, dass ich es im Stream gespielt habe und man sich das nochmal anschauen kann. Das ganze Spiel... Dachte, tell me why you waren Backstreet Boys. Ja, ich glaube aber, dass die Backstreet Boys wahrscheinlich nicht so gut sind im Spiele programmieren, wie sie vielleicht im Singen sind oder waren. Germany! Also wenn es wieder ein Spiel von Don't Not gibt, ich möchte rein theoretisch auch Life is Strange True Colors spielen, aber ich werde mir das Spiel wahrscheinlich nicht zum Release holen. Ähm ich weiß gar nicht, vielleicht streamt das Susi, vielleicht, ich weiß gar nicht, ob sie das spielen wollte. Ich glaube schon. Ähm also ich werde Life is Strange True Colors dann in zwei, drei Jahren oder so mal spielen. <lacht> ich hole mir das aber nicht zu Release. Aber ich werde diesem Genre treu bleiben. aber gewünscht, dass jetzt im Abspann noch ein bisschen schönere Musik kommt und nicht alles so düster. Dass man vielleicht ein bisschen Artwork 
gesehen hätte. Sowas mag ich ja, wenn im Abspann dann so Artwork-Sachen gezeigt werden. Musik könnte quasi ein Chase-Sound von DVD sein. <lacht> Klingt so. Gehört sich aber, dass man sich die Abspanne, die Credits, komplett anschaut. Deswegen gucken wir die auch jetzt bis zum Ende. Ich glaube, wir sind gleich durch. 